Hey, 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 DIYers, and welcome back to DIY Hookup. Today, I'm sharing with you this farmhouse wood table runner that I made. So first off, I just used this scrap piece of two by six board that I had in my scrap wood pile. And also this stick here that is one and one and a half inch stick. I cut it down to size to use for legs. Then I just used some liquid nail to glue it down and a couple of nails to nail the legs down. After that I just sand the board down really really good to get it ready for stain. I used a dark chestnut stain. I'm also using this chalk distressing paint in the color Cascade. And I, this is the color after I stained it and then with the cascade I just took a brush and just placed a little bit of the paint throughout the board because I wanted to have that two-toned chippy look. Then I covered the board in white chalk paint. I used the Rust-Oleum spray paint. It's the Rust-Oleum chalk spray paint. And then the next step was just to sand it down until I got the look that I wanted. And with the, with the cascade color that I used, underneath the white, once we sand it down, it's going to come through with the white as well. So that gives it that two-tone chippy look. And this is my final product as far as the way the chippy paint looks. I love the way it came out. It looks really worn and old, which is what you want for that chippy paint look. And you can see that cascade color coming through as well. So for the final step, you just want to seal the paint. I'm using the Waverly Clear Wax and you just want to put a light layer, a thin layer of wax, let it dry completely. And now you have your beautiful chippy paint wood table runner. I hope you guys enjoyed this easy do it yourself idea. And if you did, please give me that thumbs up, share the video, leave me a comment. And if you're new, please hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell notification so you know whenever I upload a new video. I'll see you guys really soon in the next DIY.